In this video I will introduce the updated Clipping Digital, part of my Utility Digital Pack. Every digital image consists of three primary color channels, red, green and blue. Each pixel in an image is a combination of these three channels. The balance between them creates the final colors you see on screen. In color grading, inspecting individual channels is crucial. It helps detect issues like noise and clipping. I've created a DCTL that gives you a clear side-by-side -side view of your RGB channels. Here's how it works. The image is split into four sections. Top left, the original image. Top right, the red channel. Bottom left, the green channel. Bottom right, the blue channel. This lets you inspect each channel separately while keeping the original image in view. Clipping occurs when pixel values exceed the display range either to bright, white clipping, or to dark, black clipping. In this detail, clipped pixels turn red in the red channel, green in the green channel, and blue in the blue channel. A darkening slider lets you lower the brightness of the RGB channels, making clipped pixels more visible. A threshold slider adjusts the range for detecting clipping. This makes it easy to spot problem areas that might be missed in a normal view. As you can see here, clipping can sometimes affect only a few pixels, making it hard to notice. To solve this, I added an enhanced clipping checkbox. When enabled, clip pixels expand in size, making them much easier to see. The second feature of this DZTEL helps you quickly identify saturation clipping. Make sure to disable all black clipping and white clipping checkboxes. Saturation clipping highlights pixels that have excessive color saturation, potentially causing broadcast unsafe colors or unwanted artifacts. In this DZTEL you have two options for saturation clipping. Set 100% plus 75% highlights pixels with saturation at or above 75%, helping you identify areas approaching or exceeding typical broadcast safe limits. The Z100% checkbox highlights only pixels at maximum saturation levels, indicating the most critical saturation issues. Pixels exceeding the 75 threshold are highlighted in cyan, indicating areas nearing problematic saturation. Pixels hitting 100% saturation are highlighted in yellow, marking definite problems area requiring attention. There is also an enhanced set clipping option. When enabled, pixels identified as overly saturated visually expand in size, making subtle saturation problems far easier to detect at a glance. This functionality ensures your final graded image stays compliant with broadcast and delivery standards by allowing you quick identification and correction of saturation-related issues. A DZTEL can be placed anywhere in the node tree, even before a log to REC709 conversion. This allows you to see the true RGB channels data before any major color transformation. A DZTL lets you inspect color data at any stage in the grading pipeline. With a DZTL based RGB channel split, you get a more detailed and flexible way to analyze your footage. You can check pre conversion channel data, detect potential issues earlier, and refine your grading workflow with far greater control than Resolve's default tools provide. A free demo is available on my website. Feel free to test it with your own footage. If you have any questions, leave a comment or send me an email. Have a great day and see you next time.